In 12 on Health, a local therapist says these days we hear more about inappropriate relationships between teachers and students. Not only are they illegal, but she says crossing the line can lead to long-term problems. Here's 12 on Health reporter Gillian Neff. And guys, the therapist we spoke to said too many teachers make the mistake of befriending students. And those who get involved romantically, she says, need mental health help. I think in many cases for the teacher, this actually is about power and the fact that they can have this kind of power over a student somehow is very compelling for people who aren't well mentally. Yeah. Psychotherapist Maude yeah. Purcell of the Life Solution Center in Darien says things are so casual these days that the line is being blurred and where there, when there should be a clear, clear demarcation between teachers and students. Purcell says teachers need to keep their private lives to themselves, which means stay off Facebook. She says regardless of how old a high school student is, he's still vulnerable to long-term mental health damage. If you have someone who's very vulnerable, and often these are the kids who fall into these traps with, with teachers, uh, it can affect their self-esteem, affect their, how they operate in relationships, particularly romantic relationships moving forward. Purcell says if you see a change in your child's behavior, perhaps they're isolating themselves more, it's important to sit down and discuss what's going on. It gets back to that open line of communication. We have more on this on our website, news12.com. All right, all good advice. Thanks, Gillian. You got it.